Salutations to all my favorite pups out there. Well, favorite, adventurous, courageous, stupendous, gorgeous, braverous. Wait, is braverous even a word right now? Wait, right now, like I'm like good gravy. How are all of y'all doing today? Um Good gracious. Um, so this video, I actually just bringing up this video to uh to talk about some things that I think that should be brought to your attention, uh, that you guys have brought to my attention. Um, today I have two people who are literally like family to me. Uh, I have my friend Kiki, mm. and then I have my friend Bailey. Hello, hello. And uh, today we're going to be talking about some issues. Uh, consisting of like my channel twin tail audios uh so don't worry there's nothing serious going on uh just nothing that's going to be like some like i'm quitting youtube or nothing like that trust and believe me i love doing this for you guys and i just love it i i just love having this creative corner of my life just to where i can just be creative as much as i want to um but i just want to talk about some things um so for the last like few months or so i noticed you guys have been asking me like where it's been like red and her big bad wolf part 10 at the time and i'm not upset with anybody i'm not upset with like the concept of you guys asking me or just like consistently like checking up on me i for those who checked up on me just asking me how my day was i, I cannot have asked for anybody more caring than you guys i i i just couldn't it's just at the time i was just busy and for personal and for a personal reason i decided to go back to uh some therapy uh i just needed to have a place where i could have somebody to talk to and don't get me wrong pups i love talking to you and responding to all of your uh comments and so on and so forth but uh it's nothing that your alpha your alpha has just been a little like overworked and just a little bit just like burned out so yeah i i kind of been going back to therapy and i've been loving it it's been helping me get back into my old self to where um there are some things i really want to talk to you about because that have been brought up in therapy that i really want to say that it's going to be changing onto the channel well not changing but adding on to it and one of those things is that uh next <laughs> month in july uh you know for some of you who don't know that is my birthday month and for a lot of you i am going to be getting back into doing more videos and so i'm not i'm going to take a back seek um seek Ugh. <laughs> don't laugh Kiki, I, I hear you. Don't laugh. Um, sorry, my mouth is like literally dry. I'll get some water later. But the thing about it is, is that uh, I will be doing more videos, but I'm going to take a back seat from writing a lot of scripts and just focusing on just other scripts that I find on like Reddit and just taking some of those scripts and just uploading them onto my channel and just really just using those as just like good placeholders for right now until I can work on other videos such as like Red and her Big Bad Wolf. I know a lot of you have been asking like uh where where Unlucky Opportunity um is. Uh don't worry, it's coming back. I have not forgotten it. It's just that I at the time where I was writing it, a lot of things came up, work, relationships, just like a lot of things have been preoccupied um just taking a lot of my time, so don't worry, it's coming back. I'm I, I have not forgotten about unlucky opportunity. Uh another thing is Moonlight Creek. Uh Moonlight Creek I will love to do over again, uh, but I will be cutting out the animation because the animation Kiki will tell you, like, for some of you who want to know who Kiki is, you know her as Luna. Uh Luna Flowers. And she is the voice of Becca from uh, Red and Her Big Bad Wolf. So you know her. And she'll tell you like how many hours I would spend on animation alone. 
I mean, two D animation is, is is tricky. I mean, not to say the three D animation is just is not as, but I mean the fact that when it comes to something as two D animation, it tough. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Two D animation, it it took like it just took a lot out of me, and so I'm bringing it back. I am going to be changing up some things, but. A lot of the videos is still going to be mostly the original, but it's going to be changed up a little bit. So I am going to be bringing back uh, uh, Moonlight Creek. So I hope you guys will love it again. Uh, I'll be <laughs> uploading that constantly. So I, I have like the other, uh, what is it? Episode six through 10 uh, that I've written in script form. I just never had time to record it um, or did the animation for it. Because like I said, it takes a lot of time out of me. Um, what else? Uh, what else? Um, so one crucial thing that I really want to talk about is that for the last, I want to say, Kiki, how long would you say? About like two years, two and a half years? For what? For our thing. I don't want to ruin it. The new project, you mean? Yeah, the new project. The oh, project, the... the project that you and Bailey are a part of. Oh, our D and D. Yes. So, our Bailey. D &D. Yes. For so for the last two and a half years, I've been working on uh, a D and D project, and for 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 some people that don't know, D and D is referring to Dungeons and Dragons, just in case. Yes, and I mean, I I first <laughs> had no idea what D and D stands for, but just to clarify. <laughs> And yes, yeah, so for the last two and a half years, I've been working on a homebrew campaign, which has been taken up a lot, which had taken up a lot of my time because it is a homebrew campaign. And like they, uh, like uh, Kiki said, that Dungeons and Dragons, uh, which D and D stands for, uh, is a fantasy uh, tabletop role playing game where I have not only Kiki uh, as a player, but I also have Bailey here. Uh, which Bailey, would you like to talk about a little bit about your character? Well, it's not so love. Uh, <laughs> she's definitely sober. Definitely has her head on her shoulders. Um, not um, awkward around people at all. Um. So none of that. She is a monkey girl, and she likes to drink. Oh. Um, mainly just wants to cause chaos. For tails, specifically. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah. You, you've made that obviously clear. Like, So, uh, what race are you playing? Uh, Shifter. And the class? Is a monk. Courageous. And, uh, Kiki, I... I think you're, pl I, from what I remember, you're playing a human bard, if I correct? I am a, yeah, I'm a human bard. Yeah, named Kiki, which, yes, named Kiki. yeah, so, <laughs> um, if you guys would like to check out our channel, I'll leave a link to it, uh, in the description here, because I did make a separate channel, which we, which our group name is called The Reckless Ones, <laughs> if you, if you're just hearing Bailey speak, you can already imagine the amount of chaos we have. Um, mm -hmm. Like I said, we have Kiki the Bard. We have Bailey the Monk. Uh, we have Noel the Wizard. We have Astrid the Cleric. And then we have Yunkai, our Paladin. Um, we'll be playing soon, which we're not going to be live streaming. I'm sorry. It's just that I want to make my players feel comfortable and be able to be themselves without feeling like they're being pressured. So we will be recording it and I will be uploading it. Um, so we will be expecting to will we will be recording um and uploading like two videos a month, uh, just to get our feet wet. Uh, we'll be starting off at level one. Um, I know a lot of campaigns, they start players off at level three, but since I have five players and three out of the five are new to the campaign and just new to Dungeons and Dragons in general, I just start having everybody start off like equal footing. It would be more, more easier. So that way everybody can learn 
and grow together as one rather than just like be tossed into the wilderness and say <laughs> survive on your own that's about it um also we also have something in the works uh it's not guaranteed yet but we are in the brainstorming phase i want to say kiki mm -hmm. yeah we're in the brainstorming phase um which will be coming to not this channel or any other channel but it will be coming to webtoons and we'll be calling it uh well the series because if you're not familiar with webtoons webtoons is a is a application where you can go in and you can see like third party like manga and comic strips that people have made i know i know nerd and jock is literally my favorite i i cannot stop laughing at uh the guys like i, I cannot stop laughing at his comics his his artwork and just his style and just his comedy like comics are just phen phenomenal um but uh because of that i decided to take one of my old script ideas that i've never like got into uh putting into the works but because of like uh people like bailey and my friends kiki especially who've been talking to me about it and really helping me get into it um we'll we'll be uh uploading our own webtoons called fur and fluff an unlikely pair um so it'll it's kind of consisting of like a japanese style anime kind of manga where it's kind of consists of like an anamorphic type of like society where uh our main protagonist is coming from like just moving into like an academy uh type of environment where uh our main protagonist uh has a backstory of their own but it's not to the point where uh the, that uh protagonist meets uh my character bailey's character kiki's character and a lot of our other friends characters that they start to break out of their shell and a bigger story is behind just like that story alone um our artist named scarlet hi scarlet if you're seeing this video um, she is the, uh, main art, uh, main artist who's going to be taking over the artwork. She does a fantastic job with her artwork. Um, if you guys want to see any of her artwork, uh, I'll link a, I'll put a link to her, uh, to her Instagram. Uh, she does phenomenal work. She, fantastic. Um, she did, she actually did the thumbnail for our D and D campaign, uh, which I can pull up now. Give me a second. Yasmin, the fish, Scarlet. Scarlet. <laughs> yes, mm -hmm, uh, if you sure. if you got if you uh, pups are seeing it now, uh, then you can see the animation that she did, and she uh, not only the uh, she did the artwork, uh, but another friend of mine did the animation. And as you can see, she did a phenomenal job capturing all everybody's likeness, personalities, and just the emotions evoking off of them. Uh, I don't want to get into any more details about it because I don't want any spoilers, but I, I just cannot wait to play this campaign. It's just, I know it's just going to be crazy with them. And um, what else about the yeah. campaign can I talk about? Uh, we'll be using Founder. Yeah, it's been a long time coming. Yes, yes, I know, Bailey. We've had some setbacks, like multiple, from audio issues to video issues to time scheduling issues, which is, we can all agree, which is the greatest enemy of any Dungeons and Dragons campaign. Um, For sure. <laughs> um, Sucks. But time is an illusion. It doesn't actually exist, Lamal. <laughs> oh, good gracious. <laughs> um, but what else? Um, what else? Um, I guess you can set the scene. Yeah, I mean, I can set the scene, but like I said, I don't want to spoil it for um the pups and stuff like that, cause it uh, I mean, I could, but yeah. I feel like just to get people's attention, D and D, like you know, is just kind of a generic thing. Like, but if you really want to get into it, it's basically the relationship between many people. Most of us don't even know each other. I'm new to this kind of group i didn't even know tales until what a year ago <laughs> yeah <laughs> but it's genuinely like 
throughout the game, not only do we grow closer in character, but also in people and like learning to trust each other and learn about each other's characters. It's just a journey. Uh, and and learning a little bit about yourself too. Right. Exactly. And, exactly. Like, and, how, and how you interact with people. Exactly. And especially for Tails and having to learn how to like kind of deal with the unexpected. Because if one thing's for sure, I will derail his entire campaign. Yeah, I uh, mean, did you did you want to talk about the Thunder Thive Save Live spell? <laughs> well, before I was a monk, I was a druid, and my entire idea behind it was like, I want to do thunder clap, but I don't want to do a normal wizard clap, make your hands clap. I want to make the real ones clap. Hands <laughs> on the knees, bend down, let it breathe. Let's clap. <laughs> Devastating. If you damage. pups are familiar with the twerk, that's what she was trying to do. She was trying to basically use the thunder wave spell to twerk to basically cast a thunder shock wave so powerful that it could be heard from three hundred feet away. So yeah, I'm I'm having to deal with that, but I'm I'm looking forward to it because it allows them to be themselves, and I I I, I just love creativity. So, um, make Mother Megan proud. Yes. Um. Yeah. Also, we'll be doing more games as well, too. Um, I'm looking to do more gaming as well, too. Um, sometimes with just me in there. Uh, you guys love when I did the quarry with Navy. And you guys just bombarded me. It was like, stop being so scared, Tails. Why are you running behind the pillar, Tails? Why don't you... Tails, why did you get that... Why did you get your crush killed and stuff like that? Like, come on. Like, it was... Like... You couldn't blame me. Like, I was trying not to breathe. You got your crush killed? Oh my no, no. Yeah. Okay, yes. yes. Technically, was, yes, he was, but... He was simping for a character. All because she was... I mean, to be fair, she is a badass. Because she was showing off to the boy. She was showing the boys how to hold a machine, how to use a shotgun. And she was, like, hitting the targets. I'm like, dang, Slay Queen. And if you're familiar with the, with the game, you're supposed to... Like if you if you it's all about timing. So apparently, unfortunately, he his timing was off. He ended up getting his 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 crush killed. Grab out of face and thrown thrown away like just toss and, and... bashed like a like a rag doll. It, yeah. What tales? You're such a fail woman. What the hell? Oh, good gracious, <laughs> good gravy. But uh, yeah, I'm looking to get back into gaming. So if you guys have like any game recommendations that you want to give me, please let me know. Just. Like, it, like, tell me what you're into. Um, what you're into? Like, if you're into horror, we can do horror. If you're into like multiplayer, we can do that. If you're looking for more something like chilled, like uh, what is it, Stardew Valley? We can do something like that. I'm not really a big fan, but I can give it a try if you want. Um, what? Minecraft. Minecraft. Good gravy. I I can already see her just summoning like the black dragon of death every single time. It, it it's just oh, good gravy. <laughs> I can already see it now. Minecraft and get the diamonds. Uh, but I think it's a tricky way, but I'm definitely down for mine. <laughs> As we can see, that's Bailey for you. But yes, we could definitely do uh, somewhat of like anything. Just, just don't be afraid to DM me. I'm at the end of the day, I'm just as human as you are. He is a tail. Actually, you have multiple tails. Wait. Yep. Shh. Don't reveal my secret. But anyway, yes. I'm, I'm at the end of the day, I'm just as human as you guys are. I'm Every just as... In a trench coat. Oh, good gravy. Yeah, you know what? That That's what I am. I'm two wool... I'm two... I'm two pups in a wool... In a, uh, in a trench coat looking like a full-grown man. That's my... Yeah, that's it. You just go around... Oh. No, that wasn't me. Lies. I'm just human, like the rest of you. Human. Oh, good gravy. <laughs> the way you said it. Human. 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 Uh, 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 I mean, human. Do you like more voice acting that gives you the ick, and I am the person for you. Yes. Y yes. But yes, yeah. Queen. But yeah, I'm looking to get back into gaming again. I, I, I just. Talking, having a therapist to talk to really opened up my eyes to where it made me realize why I got back, uh, why I got into YouTube in the first place, because I wanted a place to where I can let my creativity flourish. But 
making it to where I it it it, it, it I'm not gonna lie to you, pups, that it got to the point where sometimes it just felt like I I I just it just felt like a second job to me sometimes. And sometimes I would just not even want to even touch my channel. I would just want to just do my own thing, play some video games and just go on and so forth. But talking to my therapist and having like just a great community and like great friends such as like Kiki, just everybody. It, it just made me realize that I, I lost sight of why I did this. So I want to get back into that old mindset again, having it to where I can upload videos like I normally did. Just, just mm. not to where you guys are asking like, Okay, Tails, like, you uploaded, like, part eight, like, a year ago. Part nine was six months ago, and you just uploaded part ten eight days ago. Is it going to be to where it's, like, another seven months? It's not. It's not. I, I am going to upload as much as I can within a month. It won't be just one video, but... I can't guarantee it'll be like four, five, six, but it's not going to be just one video a month and then I'm just off again. I, I'm not. You guys deserve better than that. And for those who stole my squeaky toy <laughs> and my plushie of my bone, I thank you for returning it. <laughs> I couldn't sleep at night. One thing I do want to say though is do be careful. Burnout is going to be the number one killer of your passion. It, yeah, it it, it don't is. Don't put such timescales on yourself. Like, if you're going to make something creatively, don't do it just for like getting it out there. Do it in your own time. You're going to yeah. enjoy it more. Your audience will enjoy it more. It'll be more. You'll be happy with the product. So just take care of yourself, okay? Yeah. Oh, yeah especially, especially because then you end up burning out. Uh, then you end up losing the the fire of you of of that creativity yeah and that's like, called burnout <laughs> yeah and bailey bailey is right i i there were times where i felt like maybe i should just quit or maybe i should just pass my channel on to somebody else that would do a better job of it but realizing that i spent so much time energy blood sweat and tears making great connections with people there are people i've built relationships with there are people who where we've had to go our separate ways there are people where i where we don't talk anymore there are people it's to the point where now it's just i lost sight of my goal and now that i've talked to therapy have my therapist thank you miss jackie and Aww. just having a great just a great community of people and just a great group of friends helping me understand like tales like you're 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 there but you're just you you might want to take a break it made me realize that i shouldn't like put so much pressure on myself because mm -hmm. for some of y'all who do know and some of who y'all who don't know i can be a little bit of a perfectionist and because i want to give you pups the best video i can but at the same time it's like at the same time, when I try to do that, it's like I, I burn myself out, especially with Moonlight Creek. I have not touched it in so long because when I saw when I did the scripts, I just didn't want to touch it anymore because the animation just took forever. And that's just that was just by myself. The the artwork was done like the artwork was done by a great friend of mine from Fiverr and the thumbnails was done by a great creative friend of mine's. who doesn't do, um, who's not into doing commissions anymore but at the time she did my commission she did a fantastic job and i couldn't have asked for a better artist to do it because she really she she just really made really made my art she really made the artwork to the visions that i wanted and i couldn't ask for a better for a better artist than her at the time so I, I wish her nothing but the best. Even if she even though she doesn't do any commissions anymore, I still wish her nothing but the best. Yeah. Um but yeah, so if you guys want to follow me, like ask questions in the comments, don't 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 be afraid to ask anything. 
I am not going to like get defensive or like tell you to screw off or nothing like that. I, I, I respect honesty and being straightforward more than anything. If you have questions, I would rather for you to just be honest with me and just be straightforward with me rather than beat around the bush. Um, there was one more thing. My questions. Say that again. So you're actually going to answer my questions I DM'd you? Uh, I can't because we're recording and I would basically have your... No, no, no. I mean, like, you were saying, oh, I'm not going to tell you to screw off. Like... Oh, well, you're... Uh, no, I'm not going to tell you to screw <laughs> off. Good gravy. Oh, okay. Oh, see, now I'm just getting it. Um, there was one more thing. Mm-hmm. Also, um, for some of you who do not know, uh, if you guys are familiar with um, Unlock Your Opportunity, if you're familiar with uh, the voice actress uh, who plays Maxine or Max, um, that is my great friend Iris. And Iris is getting back into doing ASMR, not only doing ASMR, but also doing uh, gaming as well. Um, Let's see, uh, what else is she doing? Gaming, ASMR, and she's also starting to get into doing uh, scary story reads. So uh, I'll send a link to her uh, channel as well. Also, um, a friend of ours, where she's more like family uh, to me as well, uh, Yoonkai, or um, we'll just call her Yoon. Uh, Yoon has a uh, has a Twitch channel as well where she does games as well. And um, good gravy. It, it's kind of like having Bailey there. It's kind of like having two Baileys there. It, it, it's just that if you want to see somebody tease your... Oh, good gravy. I, I'm I'm afraid to get her on like a gaming stream with me, and she's just gonna be teasing me like tails. Why why are you hiding around the corner? Go like you you afraid of that serial killer? Yeah, I am. Tails. You don't want to play games with me? That's so mean. <laughs> Bailey, come on now. I would, but I feel like you would push me in front of the killer, run for your life, screaming your head off, and as I'm trying to get away, I'm wrapped in that <laughs> killer's big manly strong arms and. I, I, I feel my neck snap. You would like it, okay? I'm oh, hold, 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 hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Just because you like to be choked, I don't mean my character like to be choked. No, no, no. Look, come on now. I never said anything, so if you're saying it, you yeah. Know, you know, hold, hold, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. No, pops, pops, ignore it. Pops, pops, ignore that. Ignore that. Baby, I get it. We can get you a big strong man. No, no, no. I'm not into the burly man. I'm only into burly women. Oh, mm, woman. Oh, it's good. Not burly women. Oh, no. I, I don't have a. Uh, I don't have a muscle mommy. Fa- oh, no, no. Mm. Uh, excuse me. Dimitrescu coming over. You're gonna tell her no. I don't think so. Uh, to <laughs> look. Anyway. Uh, but yeah, that's about it. Um, you pups have been so fantastic to be around, and you guys have just been such a big part of this community i i would not be here at 60 i'm literally at 60 like what what is it 63 what what is it six no six thousand three hundred and three subs right now so literally my goal is to possibly get to at least eight thousand by the end of this year if i can i want to get to 10 but that, that would mean I would have to be uploading consistently on my part, which I will start be do I will start in July. Uh just due to the fact that June is kind of like gonna be a little busy just due to the fact of my job. And it, it can get busy right at the beginning of the month because people are going on vacation and like people like they, they people run their ACs like on for their pets in the house and stuff like that. So it can Oh, good gravy. I've had so many calls already. Like, ugh. But anyway. Especially if, live, especially if you live down here in Texas. Ooh. Ugh. But yeah, but yeah, Alpha is fine. I, 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 I can't say how happy I am that you guys check up on me daily, just figuring out if I'm okay. But yeah, like, uh, our D&D, our D&D series, um, our webtoons, um, uh, the gamings, uh, my two friends, everybody, the community. And like I said, oh, if I didn't mention the name of the campaign, uh, it's, uh, it's name never, uh, it, the name of the campaign is never go adventuring without a 
and you fill in the blank. blank. Yeah. <laughs> like roller, hammer, knife, sword. Or with friends. Or with friends. Like it, it it's kind of based off an anime style. Um, what is it? The anime is kind of like the campaign is kind of like a mixture of fairy tale and Hunter X Hunter. So if you are big fans of those animes or have ever been a big fan of those, you can kind of see what the style of the uh campaign will be like. Um, like I said, everybody will be starting off in level one. Um, we'll be having fun. Um, I just, because of like doing this D and D session and just coming up with this campaign, it'll be my way to relax and let this luxurious, gorgeous <laughs> hair down and let it silky, <laughs> let it, let the silkiness flow through the wind. <laughs> that luxurious mane, wolf mane of yours. <laughs> Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, but anyway, uh, but thank you for listening. Um, and all of you pups have a wonderful day, evening, night, and I'll um, were we gonna say something else? Uh, what did you want to say? Well, I mean, it's kind of personal. Did you want me to say it? <laughs> well, I mean, if you feel comfortable with it. Do you want me to say it? Say the okay. line. What are you saying? The tension. I can't handle it. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean... <laughs> Do you want me to say it, Kiki? Yes. Okay. Well, um, pups, um, Kiki and I are in a relationship. Um, she He's has... My boyfriend. <laughs> Congratulations, a beautiful, happy couple. Oh, Jeez. good. Well, I mean, we're not, you, you make it sound like we're married. We're not yet. Not, so not yet. I just pour well, up a double shot of whiskey for the uh, <laughs> dating devil. Um, <laughs> but um, Kiki or Luna has been my best friend since I started my YouTube channel. Um, she was the first person who ever like. Comment. She she commented on my first ever video, uh, back when I was starting to do other ones as well. So, like getting to talk to her and just building like a friendship with her, so like we were like best friends and, um, where we we become the whole friendship friends to lovers kind of trope, which <laughs> I am, I'm so happy. <laughs> yes, me too. And I feel like fan to love her because like you're the first comment. Oh, good gravy! Is it? Is it? I mean, does it count? No, I, 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 don't know. I guess it's you. I mean, if you want to make it, it, I mean, if it count, I mean, if you want to make it count, then yeah, it counts. Um. Oh, so we'd be like from Singing in the Rain with Kathy Selvin and uh, what's his name, uh, Gene Kelly's character. Yeah, exactly. Um. Oh, that's so cute. I'm but, like watching that when I get when I get a chance. But yeah, um, me and Kiki are dating. Um, mm -hmm. we've been uh, I want to say we've been best friends for like, like I said before, we've been best friends for like uh, friends for like five years. Um, then we started becoming best friends. Uh, what is it? Uh, two years after that, and then yeah, about yeah, and then literally uh, this this year. <laughs> a few yeah, months ago. yeah, a few months ago. Um. Uh, let's see. Well, not a few months ago. Uh, I want to say a little bit. I want to say it's almost been like ten months now, almost eleven. Um, wow. where your alpha. Uh, <laughs> ended up sending a. Uh, a very long voicemail. <laughs> uh, when your alpha, let's just say your alpha took in a little bit too much of the. Uh. Wolf's bane. Let's just say your 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 alpha had drunk a little bit too much uh too much of the wolf bane drink. Let's just say that. And uh when your alpha was just a little bit too tipsy, let's put it like that, uh I had ended up sending Kiki a uh, a voicemail telling her how I felt and we became friends to lovers, so it's like yay. <laughs> It's just that I, I'm still shy about that because it's like... I know, I'm still... I mean, that was the first for me, too. Yeah, I, I know I'm like... Like, I'm about to turn 32 in July, but it's like... I, I'm still not, like, straightforward I mean, to, like... 
I mean, we are literally going through like some like high school teenage dreams. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And Bailey here is the. Cause you make me feel like I'm living a teenage dream. Oh, good gravy! <laughs> and Bailey here yeah. is the is the uh, mean girl saying, "Get get together already!" Just, She's like, just, oh, just, 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 like, just, just get together, you crazy kids. kids. Well, no, thank you for introducing me for the mum and dad deep war. <laughs> oh, good gracious! But yeah, um, like. I, I I couldn't ask for a better group of people and I couldn't ask for a better girlfriend than mm. Kiki. I, I swear. <laughs> like like when I felt like my when I felt like everything in my life was just like burning me out, she made me feel not only you guys, but she just made me feel just relaxed mm. and goofy and <laughs> having fun. So but yeah, that's that's literally it where our relationship uh the D D campaign coming up soon uh what else what else Can I be your best man at your wedding? <laughs> uh uh i don't think so because uh that'll be for your husband's uh you could be uh luna's maid of honor well, apparently i guess he's already got reservations already. <laughs> um but yeah um our webtoon series coming up in I'll keep you guys I'll keep you pups updated on everything such as like that. But yeah, that's about it. Um so thank you for listening. I hope you pups have like a wonderful day, evening, afternoon, night, whatever time zone you in. And I love you all. So y'all have a nice one. Peace out. Bye.